Hello everyone, I am Siddharth. This is constraint part 3 in FreeCAD A2+. In previous tutorial, we learned many constraint. In this tutorial, we learn 10th constraint axis on plane angle. In this constraint, we can select either a cylindrical face or linear edge on one part and plane on the other part. Let's go to solve one example. First, we need to select a new file and select A2+. And save it. Now I am going to open first part and I am going to open second part. Select cylindrical phase on one part and select plane phase on another part select axis plane normal change the direction now select cylindrical phase on one part and select cylindrical phase on second part and select axis coincident constraint now accept it. Now I am gonna open third part. Select this cylindrical face on this part and select a cylindrical face on second part. And select excess coincident constraint. Now accepted. Now select this cylindrical face and this plane face. Now you can use axis plane angle constraint. You can change the degree of angle according to need. Now you can accept. 11th constraint plane parallel. 12th constraint plane on plane. And 13th constraint plane on angular. These constraint have similar selection. In this constraint, we can select plane on both part. Let's go to solve one example. Now I'm going to open first part. Now I'm create duplicate copy of this part. Select this phase on one part, select this phase on second part. Now you can select plane parallel constraint. Change the direction. Now select this phase and this phase. Now you can select plane or plane constraint. You can apply offset. Now select this face and select this face. Now you can use angle plane constraint. Change the degree of angle. Now select axis coincident constraint. Now accepted. 
Now I am going to open another part. Select this plane or select this plane. Now you can also use plane angle constraint. Change the degree of angle. Now choose axis coincident. I am going to open another part. Now select this face and this face. Again select angle plane constant. Now accept it. Select axis coincident constant. Now I am create duplicate copy of this part. Select the cylindrical face on both part and select axis coincident constraint. I am going to create duplicate copy of nut. Select cylindrical phase on both part and select axis coincident. Select planes on both part. Select plane on plane constant. Now I am going to open another part. Select axis coincident constraint. Now select this face and this face. Select plane or plane constant. Fourteen constant coincident at center of mass. In this constant, we can select either closed edge or plane on both part. Let's go to solve one example. I am going to open a part and create duplicate copy of this part. Select plane face on both part. Now select center of mass constraint. Change the direction. Now accept it. Select plane face on both part. And select center of mass constraint. Now accept it. Now I have complete all constant. Thank you for watching video.